Hello, this is Cory the Keyblade Wielder, and we're back for another rant. Uh, this one I have been preparing to do on this dude name Dimensions 101. Uh, if you all saw my rant on the Funny Time 77, yeah, Dimensions 101, now we get to talk about him. Uh, let's just say he's a very interesting person. Let's just say he mostly does not just Loud House, but he does all these ultimate crossovers and stuff. Plus, he's also an OC stealer. He does recolors. Like, he did Judy Hopps, like Blueberry Judy. Hmm. She probably ain't one of Willy Wonka's uh, everlasting gobstopper, did she? And then, she, he also made the future Luan Portal Master of Magic. That doesn't look all magical. It looks like an emo teen with a blood splatter or whatever. And would her hair be, like, made out of the galaxy or something? Like, if someone cut a comb on there, would that rip the fabric of space and time? That seems like a careless choice. But he also does, like, these weird posters he makes. And they all look like the same things for the Pooh's Adventure stuff. The, the Loud House in Madagascar. The Loud House Generations. Like, Sonic Generations. The Loud House Dinosaur, The Loud House Lego Dimensions, The Loud House and Stitch. Where's Lilo in this? The Loud House and the James and the Giant Peach, The Loud House and Skylanders, and The Loud House and the Wizard of Oz. It's like he's just made a spin a wheel of crossover and he picks a weird garbage. Plus, the weird part is he's got a bit of a fetish. Yeah, he's about fat fetish and big booty fetish. Ugh. Plus, I even saw parts of the DVR. He made Kim Possible really fat and also but another picture where she, Kim Possible is, you know, normal slim but made her butt bigger. Yeesh. Um, I don't have a problem with people who have some sort of fetish but if it's something like necrophilia or toddlers, get out of here. But please, if you have a fetish, keep it to yourself. Don't show it to others. Plus, he even had a photo of Lola's butt. And everyone saw June on it. Hmm, look at that perfect bottom. Like, dude, she's six years old, you bird! <sighs> Not only that, there's also a photo where he, um, where he's also a generic Teen Titans Go hater. Dude, I think it's already been established that Teen Titans Go is bad. Can we stop with the hate already? It's already established. And he's also a generic Dora hater. Dude, hating something on Dora the Explorer is kind of a, a petty topic. Plus, it's kind of stupid to hate on something that's way past your demographic. In fact, what does she even do? What is she? Was she the one that caused the 9-11? That would be terrible. Oh, boy. Yeah, that guy's an idiot, huh? Plus, he also made his own fan-made games like Crossover, where he had himself, it probably is, with one of the characters from Captain Underpants movie and one of the girls from Despicable Me. Well, good luck trying to get copyright uh, suggestion from the different companies, then. With a face like that, I can see who be the main character. <laughs> And remember when I said the Benches 101 actually, like, give him permission or something like that? Well, he kind of loses temper on him, but he wanted all the fame from him. Plus, what happened? He gave in. Dude, look, I am sorry. I didn't mean to lose my temper at you. It's just that size. Yeah, that's what it says. I just, that I want to have some of that fame like you have. I mean, our idea was so popular it became a trend on of TV tropes. You are a great Loud House fan. As a matter of fact, you're too great. I mean, a guy like me can't compete with those who got everything they always wanted. I should have been the one upset today. Dude, don't give in! First we're mad at him for stealing ideas, but now you want to give in? Where the blue man up? Okay, I'm going to stop right here. It's a, it's a medium rant, isn't it? Here's some advice to you, Dimensions 101. Firstly, Make crossovers that do make sense and not the ones that pop into your head. 
Second, stop showing us your stupid fetish. Ugh. Well, that's all I got. This is Corey the Keyblade Wielder. May your heart be your guiding key. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Oh, and uh, if you guys want a really good crossover, go watch the review reviewers' review of the Grim Tales from down below, featuring the cartoon physicist. Uh, that's how it's pronounced. So, uh, see ya.